Hello guys, welcome to English Gap. In this video, I am going to explain you how to use a phrase that you have been using it frequently in spoken English. I am going to explain a phrase that you are frequently used in spoken English. Right? Normally, in written communication, it is not used widely. But in spoken communications, it is used widely. And what is that phrase? Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay. So, let's try to find out the situation where we are using or where you normally use this particular expression. Right? Fair enough. So, I'll give you two situations with examples where you can use these expressions and once you come to know that uh, how to use it, you can use it in your daily life, right? The first expression is, I mean the first situation is that whenever certain statement or decision appears to be correct to you or seems correct or seems reasonable you can use fair enough suppose you are you are staying with your friends and you call your friends or you are i mean you tell your friends that i am washing the dishes today it's your turn tomorrow you have to do the same tomorrow then your friend will say fair enough because since you are going to do the work today it is their turn to do the same tomorrow. So, it is reasonable. I mean, it's reasonable. So, the moment some, uh, something appears to be reasonable or fair, you can use the expressions. Fair enough. This is the first example. And I'm going to give you the second example. Whenever, and what is the situation? The situation is that, I'm going to explain you. Whenever something is not, I mean, correct or it is, you are not completely satisfied with the about some things, but you are not going to complain it. Try to understand. I'm trying to repeat it for you guys. Whenever something is not, you are not satisfied with some things, you are not satisfied with some things. Or you are not completely satisfied with some things, but you are not going to complain about it. Suppose you have, I mean, booked a tick, I mean, booked a hotel, right? And seven things has been there. You just check the online catalog and you just booked it. But whenever you enter the hotel, you find something is missing. Okay. So you can say fair enough, but for one night that you are you are going to say that it's okay for me to you know to adjust for one night but next night i am not going to stay here because i have ordered some things and i get i have uh, uh, i mean i received some things right so i mean to say that fair enough is a phrase that has been widely used in spoken communications you can use whenever you want to say some statement, some decision appears to be fair or it appears to be, I mean, uh, uh, reasonable. It's reasonable, right? And in another way, you can use it whenever you are not completely satisfied about some things, but you are not going to complain, right? I have given you two examples of this short video is going to help you to use fair enough the phrase in a more I mean correct way right thank you and kindly share the videos for benefit of others I'll come with a new video tomorrow till then bye see you